Hello Street Hunters, it is time to make another Street Hunt video and this time we are going to be hitting the beach instead of the streets and that's why I'm wearing my shades, outside it's bright and sunny, it's really hot it's the middle of the day, uh, I know it's not the best time for shooting street but that's only the only time I have available so uh, we're gonna go now today I'm gonna be using a film camera I have quite a few Yashikas, so for today I've chosen this one. This is the Yashika GTN. It has a lovely 1.7 45mm lens. Very sharp. Very sharp with a great reputation. This is a rangefinder from the 1970s. And uh, with this rangefinder I will be using one of the world's finest grain colour films. Because of course we're shooting on the beach. so color is like the way to go it's Kodak Ektar 100 it's a medium speed film they classify 100s as medium speed films it's a medium speed color film that with nice vivid bright colors and I'll be shooting it at ISO 80 instead of ISO 100 just to overexpose it slightly and make the uh, the results look even brighter and nicer uh, in addition, I am going to use a skylight filter. The skylight filter is just a piece of glass that goes in front of your lens and uh, helps correct colors. And it also helps protect your lens. It makes colors uh, a little, it adds a little slight hue of magenta, uh, making colors, making, for example, the sky not look so bright blue, but it, it's, it's nice. The result is nice. And I'm also going to be using this. This is just a simple rubber lens hood. There you go. And now I've got the setup ready. The lens hood is a bit wonky, but I don't mind. It's just a simple one euro rubber lens hood. Does its job perfectly well. I don't care. So that's it. I'm ready. I'm just going to load the film in the camera and I'm going to hit the beaches and you'll come with me and we'll have some fun. So see you in a bit. Stay sharp and keep shooting. Okay, so I am at the beach. As you can see, this is the beach of Rechino. It, uh, it's quite big. If I stand up, and maybe you can see how far it uh, reaches out. Well, not really. Well, anyway, I'll start walking and explaining things along the way. But this time, I will try and make uh, more snappier editing as per the suggestion of a friend make the video a little bit faster like it's uh, got more action so I will not be talking so much maybe I will have commentary as I always do but I'll try and uh, have the commentary only when I'm making shots so uh, to speed things up anyway let's get started This path is a nice leading line to capture photo. Luckily, the wind is on and off, so uh, I hope you get good audio. Now, I like this curb here, and I'm going to take a photo of these ladies as they as they walk. There we are. Here, what I like is the face of the uh, of the uh, that thing, what do you call it? Parachute. So I'm going to come here in the middle put the parachute in the top left corner give the picture a little bit more sky make composition and shoot like that come on I just need one person in the shot not many there
I'm trying to shoot the whole roll here, which is a bit difficult. But I think I can manage. I think I got the bird in there as well. Sorry for having the screen tilted for so long, but I had to compose my shot. Let's hope it's a good one. Nice. I think I can make this shot on time if I just move a little bit closer. Focus and Thank you. I might not comment so often uh, when I'm closer to people because it's uh, when it's not windy, it's terribly quiet, so people can uh, hear me talking, and uh, it's a bit weird, a bit strange for them. I can totally understand that. Seeing a guy talking to himself with a big film camera and a video camera strapped to it on the top must seem kind of, you know weird so uh, when I'm close I won't comment I might comment after the shot I like the way the path leads out to nowhere I will wait until someone walks on it and then make a shot oh, why not shoot now with the old ladies in the scene nice I'll try and get a composition of people doing you know all sorts of things like him changing yeah, that'll be fun. You know, random movements. They're fun. I really like the curve that's uh, shaped from the stairs here and the whole area in there and the uh, well, the whole, you know, composition here. So I'll wait for something to happen, like a movement or something, and then I'll take a shot. So now I'm focusing somewhere else. I'm going to turn and compose and make a shot. So that way I don't spend lots of time focusing. Using a uh, narrow aperture and focusing, well, close to the distance I want. I know that I'm going to be in focus. So this is going to be a hip shot. I don't know if I've got anything. We'll see. I pre-focused and I just went and uh, brought the camera down and took a shot. I don't know if uh, I got anything. explaining really set my lens on hyperfocal distance not to waste uh, precious time focusing so this way anything that's longer than uh, three distant three meters away is in focus so here's the classic so shot I wanted to take I just want that umbrella there and the two-thirds on the right lift the camera up so I've got three parallel colors sand sea sky and take a shot it's a very classic shot but I, th I like it so I'm going to focus on the wall here and wait for him to come and compose with one umbrella in there and a boat
I enjoy this corner composition here a lot. I'll take this shot here, like that. When the lady shows up, better end it there. And now I'm going to take a shot of my love, my favorite no pooping sign. It's against the sun, so I'll go the other way. Sorry. Can't seem to focus. There I am. There. No pooping. It's a funny one. So I made that shot. I've just spotted this guy doing his gymnastics on the uh, ledge. So here's a photo just for him. Snap! Snap, snap, snap! Scene. That would be great. Ah, if I move over here. Yep, here he is. And I can put the whole thing in like so. Thank you, Mr. Skinny Guy. Hmm. Okay, someone's coming now. As you can see, I'm uh, looking into the mirror outside of a hotel, the reflection. So that way I... Now I'm going to make a shot here of the flag. Kind of difficult to focus because it's moving all the time. Oh, yeah, so the guy is there. Yep. I think that came out. Okay, remind me not to do this again, it's too hot, Ooh wee I need something cold. Okay, so this is a nice cabinet here. So I'm gonna take a photo. But I'll get, get closer to so this cabinet. 
open it here. That's a nice shot. Through the cabinet hole. Still got photos. Good. Hey, what's this dude doing? finished. That was it guys and girls. A beach street hunt. I hope you enjoyed your time. You know what I'm gonna say. Stay sharp and keep shooting. Until next time.